it's your girl April. So today's video is going to be something easy. This is by Free Trust Equal and it's also available at samsbeauty.com. Now this one I have seen on plenty of websites. Um, a lot of them didn't have the color that I was looking for which was a solid color but this unit does come in like an array, a huge variety of colors. More colors than solids but I figured I would still give it a try because I thought it was really cute. The color that was advertised is more or less like a, um, a nude blonde and then there's a gold pink gold one um, that kind of took away from the look for me you know how I feel about synthetic wigs and just very very colorful colors it all depends on the style too for me like certain styles I won't wear very colorful but you know to each is own the wig is absolutely gorgeous it has like this natural kind of like yakky light yakky texture and it's very curly and wavy the one thing that's really good about this unit is the um, the lace which is more or less a Swiss lace it has a great part in it of course I took a couple of strands out nothing major I really didn't have to do much to it but it had a really great part in it and it is a um a middle part but you know you can put this basically anywhere so I'm gonna situate it to the right side I could have put it as a middle but I didn't prepare my hair like that it does come with the two combs in the front and the comb and the adjustable strap in the nape area but she is actually really really cute and in advance I'm gonna apologize to you guys because it seems like I'm going to just start doing my videos, recording my videos at night when there's no sunlight. I love the natural light because it just gives me the perfect setting or what have you. But it seems like one minute the clouds want to be there, the next minute they don't. So, And I hate for my video to keep changing in color. So if it does that because it has done that while I was preparing for this video, just bear with me. You know, I'm thinking about just recording at night with just regular lighting. So, yes, with that being said, let's do this time. I know that it's late, but baby, I'm up and I'm thinking about you, about you. Get you on the line and see if it's okay if I could come through, to come through. Feeling kind of lonely, I think I'm needing a dose of my blood, of my blood. Just left the studio, I can be there in 10 minutes. Is that cool? Is that cool? Been craving your love and your body on mine. Hope I ain't break you, but I need your time. you guys all right ladies so let's give it to free trust equal deluxe for this unit it's absolutely gorgeous do you see the hair the number one suggestion for this one is finger comb the hell out of it okay yes finger comb the heck out of this unit I mean if you are feeling lucky you can use a wide tooth comb and it may make the process a little bit easier or faster for you but my suggestion I always finger comb them because your fingers are less harsh, they're not as hard as a comb would be. You're gonna be a little bit more gentle than you would with a comb because this is your fingers. So that would put less stress on the unit to me. It wouldn't frizz it up. That's why when you see me with curly units or wavy units, I always use my fingers to finger comb them because you can get the desired look, but you're also being a lot less harder on the unit. So I like to finger comb them because if you start putting a brush to them, even like a paddle or a vent, 
brush and a comb, you may just overdo it because it is a harder tool and you know, you won't get the long lasting effect and it might just be too big for you. So I always suggest a finger combing it. So the hair came out really, really cute. I like it a lot. I'm not really sure how I feel about it as a middle part, especially the way they have it situated on the model. Not knocking the model Talia at all, but I just like it a lot better as a side part. That's the great thing about middle parts. You can always situate them to your liking. And that's what I like about this one. Even if you put it to the side, it's not taking any of the length away, meaning it's not making it look lopsided. It can get bigger. That depends on how you feel about it. But me personally, I like it this volume. It's not too much. It's The hair looks really natural, especially when you finger comb it. I don't like my waves all tight and close because it kind of looks like it's more or less packaged. So that's why I like to actually finger comb it. So the color that the actual model is wearing is called TS Crunch. I'm not really sure about the color Crunch. I've never really seen that in a Crayola box. Um, and that was that blonde wig color that I was talking about. So I guess that's like some new color, you know what I'm saying, the color Crunch. But either way, I love it more in a natural color. But like I said, to each his own, you can get it in a blonde. I'm pretty sure this will look really nice though in the color Crunch that the model is wearing. However, you would need to customize it to your liking. More or less like put it to the left, right, or middle but just still customize the part a little bit so that way you can see it. So that's why I always suggest doing a little bit of tweezing, a little bit of concealer, some hairspray, whatever, and you got yourself a really, really expensive looking wig for God knows how much less than, you know, a virgin price. But this is a great wig dupe. I like the color a lot. It's a really great wig dupe for any kind of like curly unit. This reminds me a lot of like the unit that I did, um, Gosh, I think it was probably like over a month ago. It was really pretty. It was like the same length. It was AliExpress hair. It was deep wave. The only difference is this is synthetic versus virgin. And also the only difference is the price match. You know what I'm saying? So for those of you girls who don't want to spend a lot on a bunch of hair, then by all means, don't. Girls, don't. Just get you a nice blue, really inexpensive wig. And girls, you will be on fleekity fleek, like they say. You know what I'm saying? So yes, you can check out Sam's Beauty for this one right here. I will post all of the information below for you guys. And I'm pretty sure you guys already have noticed I have made it to 100,000 subscribers. So I'm super excited and I'm thanking every Everybody because if it wasn't for you guys I would have no subscribers so yeah stay tuned for an upcoming giveaway video that as well as that as I just want to say thank you guys so much for just sticking with me sticking it out with me on all of my channels you know this is my third channel that I had to start over so I appreciate all the love and support because you know what I'm saying I could have just said the heck with it and not came back but you know I'm glad that I have a lot of supporters out there on YouTube as well as any social media that makes me feel loved welcomed and just makes me feel good to do YouTube videos. So on that note, I love you guys. Check out the description box for Talia. And as always, let me know what you think of this unit. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. And I love you guys. Stay diva and divalicious as I would always say, and I'll see you soon.